hey y'all so welcome to another vlog i am leaving athens and i am on my way to amsterdam so my airbnb host is going to take me to the airport and i have a three hour flight to amsterdam so yeah i'm excited i'm tired it's super early it's like 8 30. so he said he would be here in five minutes um so i'm all packed and ready to go and yeah so let's get on the road that was so weird <laughs> at this restaurant called Eggs and Co. <laughs> and I spent so much money. I got this little drink and then a chicken burger for 16 euros. Um, but it's really cute in here. I'm in Amsterdam. It's been a rough, <laughs> it's been a rough day. Huh. My period came on on the plane. So that's what I'm feeling right now. I'm very annoyed. I've been really hot. So like I'm, I've been sweating from head to toe all day because I dressed for Amsterdam in Greece and Greece is still hot and humid. So I've been hot and humid all day. So I am taking the bus to my Airbnb um, the bus station or the bus stop is right outside of the airport so I catch it there and it goes straight to the stop that I need so I don't have to transfer anything which is good I'm about to eat and as soon as I drop my stuff off I'm gonna go to the coffee shop and get off because I need it like bad <laughs> like look at my face I've been sweating all day Well, this actually looks really good and I forgot that in Amsterdam they eat their fries with mayonnaise so I'm asking for dipping sauce and she's like yeah it's right there um, I'm used to dipping with some barbecue sauce or honey mustard so this will be interesting so I made it on the bus and I look crazy I am so overwhelmed, but it's okay because I made it on the bus and I am on my way to my destination. frustrated I missed my bus stop twice so now I'm waiting for the next bus like I really just want to throw something and break it I almost just now just threw my phone like I almost threw it and broke it and cracked it <laughs> I'm so annoyed um so I have three three minutes until my next bus gets here so it's really dark, but while I wait on my Airbnb, I mean, while I wait on my bus, I just have a quick story. So as you guys know that I have had a day, you know, my period came on, I've been traveling, I done missed my bus stop, blah, blah, blah. So, and on top of that, I get lost trying to find the actual Airbnb. So I'm walking and the lady comes out and she's like yes 
as if she wanted to say what are you doing here or i don't belong there like the way that she said it was rude as fuck i was like is this airbnb she's like yeah i'm like what the fuck bitch you know that i'm on the way how are you coming at your house acting like this the only reason like the first thing that came to my head is i have no other option but to stay here but literally what i wanted to do was be like bitch i don't have to stay here like you can give me my money back and i can go somewhere else that's literally what was on the tip of my tongue but then i thought like what in the world girl you literally do customer service for a living like you post people in your house how are you acting like this this is my best I don't think this is my book. Is it? Towards Zuid Amsterdam. Lord, y'all, I'm about to miss my bus. I don't know. Oh no, I'm at the right station. Today has been a day, a whole day.
so what I got was a edible, which is cake. I got a red velvet cake. And I also got a pre-roll. I don't know why my camera don't want to focus. So when I was here last time, I didn't walk down this far and there's quite a bit of food options. So what I wanted to do was get high and then go eat because my food is a hundred times better when I do that. I just need to find somewhere to smoke. I don't know, there's a lot of people smoking on the sidewalks, but I don't, I, technically that's not legal. I don't think find somewhere to like smoke. I'm thinking about going in one of these like back alleys or something and you know doing the do. <laughs> Ew. No. But there's a lot like this place right in front of me it's called Harlem. It says drinks and soul food. So I wonder what their idea of soul food is because I would hate to go into it thinking that it's my type of soul food and then I get in there and it's not just gonna walk and like see what there is to eat um, the weather is it's like letting up it was raining pretty hard today when I left now it's not it's like drizzling it's cold but honestly with all this walking I think it like my body is warm so the the air kind of feels pretty good it's cold though it's probably like 50 degrees maybe less and rainy so but there's a lot of people still out still doing stuff but it is Sunday, so I think stuff closes a little bit earlier. These people have a message for you scamming assholes. A deer burglar. <laughs> this neighborhood is so cute. Alright guys, it's time to party. I have went through about three-fourths of my joint pre-roll okay Lonnie. hey so let's eat i seen a place that had wings and fries that look pretty good um but i also really 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 want some pasta with some shrimp so I seen a place that had pasta, like a shrimp pasta, I guess. So I think I'm gonna go there and get some pasta. I look so cute. <laughs> Dang, I really might go to both places. I'm, I'm pretty hungry. Dang, this some sausage. Dang, I wanna try all these places. I'm hungry. Oh shit. <laughs> I almost hit somebody with my umbrella and I almost fell. Is this the place with the shrimp? Remember when I said I lost my appetite? That bitch came back. Hey, all of my food and it was really good like, really really good I don't know what I'm doing now because now I'm cold and I've been sitting so I'm cold and I need some warmth something to eat I 
kind of want like some really good juice but like a biscuit and it's eight I got here I got up so early I could have slept a lot longer um, going through security and everything only took me like 30 minutes so I could have slept in easily till nine o'clock but better early than late so just need to find something to eat there's my spot that I slept at last time I got a good little nap over there I might go back <laughs> mango tea um, from Starbucks it's pretty good and I got a ham and cheese croissant and a chicken bacon avocado so so I am at my gate and it's time is moving so slow it's only 9 54 I got up early for no reason. I think boarding starts at 11.15. My edible is like peak. I feel like I'm, it, I'm peak high right now. Yes. And I just ate, that food was so good. I ate every last bite. I literally got, got my appetite back as I'm leaving. This is the most that I've spent on food since I've been away. I look like yesterday. Hello. Hashtag OOTD. Hey guys, so I am on American soil, I am in DC, waiting on my plane. I am so tired of being in airports and waiting on flights and walking through airports. <laughs> like, I'm so tired. But um, I just wanted to say that I had a really good time and I'm so blessed and excited to be able to see the world. I recommend anybody going to Amsterdam. The people there are so nice with the exception of my Airbnb host. <laughs> Which, and her husband was nice. It was just her. My face is breaking out. It's tired of traveling as well. But yeah, Amsterdam is beautiful and I do plan on going back. I will say um, that edible did not do so well once I got on the plane. Actually, before I got on the plane, I started feeling very sick. Kinda like, um, it kinda felt like I had a hangover, like the next morning type hangover. Look at West Mom. Just let it keep yelling. That was weird. I had to like lay there and take a nap. It was bizarre. And then I got on the plane. I'm like, okay, I'm feeling better. No, I wasn't. It was so bad. I don't know if it was the edible or if I, it was because I ate. I don't know. I've never felt like that with any type of weed product. So, unless I've done too much. I'm feeling a whole lot better now. I slept the whole, pretty much the whole eight. I slept about seven and a half hours. I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog. I am tired. <laughs> and... I think my plane doesn't leave for like, like an hour, an hour and a half. I still got the scarf on. My wig is not on, honey. It's not secure. I want to thank you guys for watching, and I hope you like these type of videos. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be posting more traveling videos on my channel. So hopefully you guys love it, and yeah. 
thanks for watching and don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel i don't even know what i'm saying to like comment and subscribe to my channel and i will see you guys in my next video my face i need a facial